you're watching What's Trending from the Samsung studio at VidCon 2014, I've lost my voice. And this is Shay Carl. Howdy. <laughs> yep. Sure. So you've been to VidCon every year. Yes. What is it like for you this year? You know, it's it just gets bigger and better every year. It's it's exciting. I really do. This is like three days that I really look forward to coming to Anaheim. The kids love it. This has been really a good year for me. I had a sweet meeting with Facebook, and they're like showing me all these analytics and like best practices. So I feel like as a creator, this has been the best VidCon for me. Really? I've you know just with brands, and I, m I met with the people that I'm doing a book with, and they get is to that see, so cool? Oh yeah, yeah. Right, he's doing a book. Who'd buy a book? book? I'm writing a book. Right? Yeah. So, Shay, I mean, so much has happened for you this year. Maker got bought by Disney. That's a good thing. Right? It's a very good thing. Yeah. So that was a big deal also for the industry because you guys have set the standards. You created really the model. And then to, to sell to a big company, it's right. changing things up. I think it gets a lot of people's attention. Yeah. You know, the Walt Disney Company is a respected company that's huge and everybody loves Disney. We're here in Anaheim in Walt Disney's backyard. And I'm contractually obligated to say that. No, just kidding. But yeah, it's exciting. Then DreamWorks buys Big Frame, and I think it's. I think people are really taking this seriously. You know, this this is a new way to entertain and to connect and communicate with people around the world. And you don't have to, you know, do the traditional thing anymore. It's like you can create things that you like and get it in front of millions of people's eyeballs. I know, it's awesome. And we love eyeballs. I love every one of your eyeballs. Both of them. They're, they're pretty eyeballs. Yes. Well, where do you think that's gonna help? Clap for eyeballs. <laughs> this guy's like, I got two eyeballs. He's talking about me. How do you think that's gonna change all of the stuff in this community? Is it gonna change the fact that traditional companies are coming in? Yeah, I mean, there's there's always some growing pains. I feel yeah. like you know there you know nobody wants anything to get too corporate, you know, because you don't want to get the fun out of it. But um, even just meeting with Atria, my book publisher, for example, I hate to keep pushing that I'm writing a book, but you know they're getting it more and more where they trust the YouTuber to do what they would normally do. Because yeah. a lot of times when corporations come in, they're like, "This is how we do it. This is how you're going to do it. We're in control of you." They're understanding that a lot of these you know, content creators, they know what they're doing. Yep. That's the reason they have these audiences. And if they trust them, then there'll be, you know, a really symbiotic relationship that happens. And so that's happening a lot. What do you think about other platforms like Vine, Instagram video, all these other places that people are building community? People are thinking like, oh, now th this is the thing. It's not YouTube anymore. Right. It's going to happen. Yeah. I, I think a lot of companies are doing that. They're trying to create their own YouTube at this point. It's hard for me to envision a day when YouTube isn't like it, like YouTube. Like there will always be things that come along. I just feel like YouTube will always kind of be the first and the biggest one. And I think there's room for other things, you know, other video platforms, other websites. Uh, but I, I feel like YouTube will always kind of be like the base of that. Thanks for joining What's Trending with <laughs> Sheer Lazar and Shay Carl. Be sure to tune in, subscribe, thumbs up this video, and subscribe to Shay Carl. Pretend you like me, pretend you like me. Good, it's a wrap, we got it, okay good. <laughs>